hello guys in this video i am going to show you how you can install one of the best ocr model locally and privately we will also be not only installing it we will also do an ocr on an image if you don't know what ocr is ocr stands for optical character recognition it is a technology that extracts text from images or printed documents such as scanned papers photos of text PDFs, screenshots, it uses algorithm to recognize and convert text characters enabling you to edit, search and digitize printed or typed content. Microsoft has this uh, released this awesome model called as TROCR Large Printed. The TROCR model is an encoder decoder model consisting of an image transformer as encoder and a text transformer as decoder. The image encoder was initialized from the weights of byte while the text decoder was initialized from the weights of Roberta. Images are presented to the model as a sequence of fixed size patches. Resolution should be 16 by 16 which is really recommended and these are then linearly embedded. One also adds absolute position embedding before feeding the sequence to the layer of transformer encoder Next, the transformer text decoder auto regressively generates the tokens. You can use the raw model for optical character recognition on single text line images. You can also use a lot of fine tuned variants and you can check it out on Hugging Face. But for this one, we are just going to go with this vanilla TROCR, which is similar to others. Also, this model has been fine tuned on this SRYE um, data set. It was introduced in the paper TROCR which you can find here and I will drop the link in video's description. Okay, that's enough. Let's go to my local system and then see how can we get it installed. Let me take you to my Ubuntu system where I'm running Ubuntu 22.04 and my memory is 32 GB. Let me clear the screen. Make sure that you have transformer library installed. I already have it, so I'm not going to install it again. That's done. Let me load my Python interpreter where I'm going to install, download and run this model. First up, let's import some of the required libraries, including tier OCR processor and vision encoder. Let's also import below because we will be dealing with an image. And then let's also import the request because we will be making some HTTP requests. Let's get an um, sample image and I'm also going to show you that image in the browser first. So this is an image which we are going to OCR. Yes, it is a bit cryptic, but let's see if the model is able to recognize it. Let's go back to our um, terminal and now let's give the URL to this image. It is hosted online. You can use any local images if you like. And let's get this image opened with the help of that request library, which I showed you. That is done. Now image is stored here. And now specify our model. And then the model is, as you can see, TROCR large printed. And this is going to download tokenizer and all the related files that is done let's specify our vision encoder decoder model at a high level in simple languages vision simply means that it can recognize and understand the images and there is only one tensor of this model and you can see two which is the size is 2.43 the size is quite good i mean when it comes to the model and this is what i really like about this model is that is only does one thing and it does it good and that is OCR. So let's wait for this download to finish. Model is almost downloaded. It will validate the checksum and then we will generate the pixels. Okay, so that is done. Let's get the pixel from the model. And this is a processor which we have specified in this variable above. That is also done. And now let's get the uh, generation from model. I'm just simply going to press enter and then 
yes sorry i just i think didn't copy it properly sorry about that so you can ignore the previous line i'm just going to copy the next command i'm just generating the ids from the model here which is basically the output or the ocr which model is doing that is done and now let's get the generated text and let me print it out generate it underscore text i hope typing it correctly there you go so let's see so it is just printing what it found in the text so pretty cool so this is easy it is this is how lightweight this model is so that's it guys i hope that you enjoyed it let me know what do you think if you know of any other similar model which can do ocr in open source let me know happy to try it out if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching